Matus. So, what is being 25 black and having my own magazine? Job workers do have their own unique voice in terms of fashion, music, and youth culture. And that's how I've kind of formulated the vision uh, I'm behind Unlabeled. It serves as a platform to represent South African black people. South Africa is really in an interesting place. Our parents or generations before us didn't have certain opportunities. So you find that a lot of young people kind of realize that it's up to us to kind of shift the future. My name is Maya, show my Josie for the culture. I rap in my mother tongue, right? So I rap in Tonga, which is not something that people have really heard being done. I rap in a language that's kind of looked down on in this country, so it's not seen as cool. Like Tonga people are supposed to be ugly. You know, I'm a woman that's rapping, so that's also like kind of different. African peopleism, that's what this shit is about. It's about figuring out what does it look like to be African today. Like, so you're either like super traditional or you're like really Western. South Africa is quite different from other African countries. We don't want to be boxed as typically African. It's about breaking away from that and showing that we're much more than that. So we try to find our own identity. My name is Bangy's Dead. I'm not a fashion designer, but my main, main thing is making clothes. That's like my passion, that's what I die for, yeah. Basically make art, <laughs> everything. I don't want to get caught in this whole trend thing, you know what I mean? I don't know how to do all these mood board things, all these drawing sketches of the clothes. Yeah. I just wake up in the morning if I have a good idea. If the same idea keeps popping up, it's the one in my head and that's what I do. Like my recent drop had like four pockets on shorts. That's because I recently lost my wallet so I need a lot of pockets so I can keep my stuff. Bangi is a streetwear designer. His label is called Dead. I feel like with his personality and his view on design, he's very much about setting trends and being different and standing out. And that translates very well in um, his clothing. He's been able to understand the power of photography and marketing. We're shooting for Unlabeled magazine, um, Dan Creatives in Joburg. Anthony Bila. Chisanga Mubanga and myself, Nicholas Rohani. We all work as photographers and I also work as a videographer. For each of our subjects, we pick like one camera that we're going to use and then we kind of tag team it. So depending on the vibe that each one of the three of us kind of feel, if we get an idea and we see the scene. So we're constantly swapping and rotating in terms of the way that we're shooting. And that kind of also gives you like three perspectives on any particular subject. We're not like tied down to any particular medium. It's more just about finding the exact medium that's perfect for that form of expression. They're relevant because they kind of know what's happening in the streets. So they very much have their ears to the ground and they know what's what. The most interesting thing for me is literally just getting the people from the areas to tell their own stories. And all I do is document the narrative and put it together rather than being a mouthpiece or a spokesperson for people who should be speaking for themselves. We're in a really interesting time where people who might have not have had opportunities, now have the platforms to say stuff. Obviously we've got a bit of a following in South Africa, people know us and a lot of brands try to take advantage of that in South Africa by just getting a blogger who's got 100,000 followers to you know, wear a pair of sneakers and say I love this brand and we're, we're kind of completely opposed to that. Instead, we really believe creative should be unchained and unfettered and when that happens there's a sincerity in it that all people can connect to. I think um, if we can contribute even a little just to the imagery that comes out of Africa, just by Africans, you know, it's really important and of high quality. And I think if we get that right, legendary status will come after. I think we just need to actually do good. The audience now, I think, is more open minded to unique sounds and ideas. My name is Langa Mavuso. The last person to tell me about my music said it's like left field alternative. 
It could be a sound like you can jam to it, but if you actually listen to the words, it's like, it's all about relatability at the end of the day. If you're going to share a story that people can relate to, love, pain, happiness, joy, sadness, those kinds of themes will always make people relate to the music. Langa Mabuso is a soul jazz musician. He also has like an amazing stage presence and um, great sense of style. And in Joburg, if you're doing something creative, you also have to dress really well. I don't know if you guys noticed that. I'm Neo Sorati and I'm a designer. I love the gay subculture in Joburg. They all have sort of a woman has inspired their look. I don't think anybody thinks this is for women and this is for men. I think everybody just finds something beautiful and wears it. It's just the way we live right now. His label is very, very progressive in the sense that his designs are gender neutral. He's a gay menswear designer and um, his designs kind of reflect his sort of views in terms of gender. Because we're still trying to find our identity, a lot of musicians, um, fashion designers, are trying to not be boxed into Western culture. I think we're exciting because we're different and we have our own story that's not the story that's been told for, for, for many years. It's not your stereotypical Africa, it's, it's a new right now Africa, it's what, it's what we're thinking right now. You know, it's all about not trying to fit in, but trying to fit out, but in your own way. Even if it's something that's been done before, but it's about you making it look fresh in your own way. Not like trying to, yeah, you know, yeah. I hope that makes sense. <laughs>